Hey everyone, welcome to my garden. And today I want to give you seven reasons why you should be growing ground cherries. Number one, they're super easy to grow. You don't really have to do anything, there's absolutely almost no maintenance required in this plant. You just can kind of let it grow and let it do its thing. You don't need to come in or trim it, do any type of clipping or cutting back. You could just let this plant grow. Number two, this plant is a self-pollinating plant, meaning the flowers will blossom, pollinate themselves, close up, and right behind them, a fruit, an edible fruit will start growing. Number three, it's super simple to clone and take cuttings off of this plant. You could take transplants, so there's almost a, an unlimited amount of transplants that you could take just off of one plant alone and then off of those plants you could take transplants so the numbers are really up to you as far as how many plants you want to be growing number four this plant is a very productive heavy producer as you see just looking around pretty much every single place you look underneath the the branches here underneath the leaves you see ground cherries and that's these beautiful edible round little lanterns and inside there's a delicious little berry that's growing. Number five, this plant grows very well indoors as well as outdoors. So if you have a limited amount of space or you just want to try to grow this plant indoors as well especially during the winter time, this is a great plant to grow and you'll have a, great, you'll have a ton, of, ton of success. Number six, this plant grows extremely well in a hydroponic Kratky system or a deep water culture system, whichever one you prefer. I've grown this plant both ways and both ways result in very good success and you will have a ton of lanterns and ground cherries forming everywhere. And number seven, this plant is delicious. These berries that form Technically, these aren't berries. This is part of the nightshade family, so it's similar to a tomatillo. So it's more of like a like a little tiny tomato. Very delicious, and ultimately tastes really good. So if you want to have a delicious little tiny little ground cherry growing, grow this plant, and you'll enjoy. Hopefully, you liked the episode. If you did, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and maybe subscribe. Thanks for watching.